Beagles are small hounds that were originally developed to hunt rabbits and other small game, making their incredible sense of smell as one of their best features. They are also sturdy dogs with good temperament, but they can also be lazy. If you're wondering whether Beagle is the perfect household pet to your home, make sure to watch the video until the end because for today, we will talk about the 8 reasons why you should not get a Beagle. In the 1840s, Beagles were brought to the United States to help with the hunting. In 1885, they were officially recognized by the American Kennel Club. Beagles have a spotted coat that comes in various colors from brown to black. Their coat is mixed with areas of white. Due to their marvelous sense of smell, today beagles are not only used as companions, but they are also used by various government institutions to inspect food items and other suspicious products to determine if they are safe. As we go through this video, we'll get to know more about these wonderful dogs. Hey there and welcome to Smart Dog Lover. If you're looking for a channel that features dog-related stuff every day, then you're in the right track. So make sure to subscribe to our channel. As mentioned at the beginning of this video, today we'll talk about the 8 reasons why you should not get a beagle. So let's get started right away. Number 1. Beagles are extreme diggers. First things first, beagles are best friends with dirt. Whether it's in your yard, at the park, or anywhere with dirt, this breed will love to jump, play, and just roll in it. Sometimes they will even eat the dirt. Therefore, you should expect them to create large holes in your yard, so it is important to supervise them at all times unless you want your yard to be filled with holes. Fortunately, you can control them from doing such behavior by proper training. Once you see them starting to dig, command them to stop, and if they follow your command, reward them with treats and praises. However, keep in mind that you cannot completely eliminate their tendency to dig as they are naturally born with such behavior. So, if you do not fancy a dog that digs a lot, or if you cannot control their digging behavior at the very least, then you should not get a beagle. Number 2. Beagles bark a lot. Another reason why a beagle might not be for you is because they are known to bark a lot. However, their bark is not the same with other dogs who may bark to show authority. Instead, their barks are closer to a howl. These dogs may bark to sing with the music, when they try to communicate with you, or when they are spooked by something. Keep in mind that beagles get scared by almost anything even if it is a spider, a fly, insects, or imaginary sounds, this breed will bark to express their feelings. While their howls can be seen as a cute behavior for some, it may create some noise complaints from your neighbors. Therefore, if you live in a home with noise restrictions, or if you live close to your neighbors, then this breed might not be the best choice for you. Number 3. Beagles shed all over the house. Although beagles have short coats that do not need extensive grooming, it doesn't change the fact that they still do shed. In fact, beagles will shed their fur more heavily twice a year in spring and fall. So, if your dog loves to relax on your sofa and other furniture, expect those loose hair to stick all over the house, including your clothes. Fortunately, you can reduce, but not totally eliminate, the amount of hair that they shed through daily brushing during shedding season. Outside shedding season, brushing them twice or thrice a week is enough to keep their hair tidy and to evenly distribute their natural skin oils, thus keeping their fur in its best condition. Bathing should only be done a few times per quarter. However, since they like to play on dirt, you should thoroughly wash their paws and feet using water before going inside the house. Don't use soap too often, as it will dry out their paw pads. With that said, if you are an allergy sufferer or you are simply looking for a hypoallergenic dog, then this breed is not the right choice for you. The same is true if you don't have enough time for grooming. Number 4. 
beagles are easily distracted. Because of their incredible sense of smell and strong tracking instincts, beagles will not be obedient all the time. For example, if you're taking them out for a walk and they catch a scent that arouses their curiosity, they will surely run and follow the trail even if you call them out a few times. Therefore, if you're taking them outside, make sure that you keep them on a leash so that they won't get lost. Additionally, if you have a yard, make sure that it is securely fenced above and below the ground as they can easily dig the soil and create a tunnel to escape. But when it comes to play sessions, this breed will happily play with you, especially when it involves their tracking skills. Games such as hide-and-seek using their favorite toys or treasure hunts involving their favorite treats are some of the games that you can play with them. Overall, if you're looking for a dog that will run you for miles without getting distracted, or if you are not confident about handling a dog with this kind of personality, then Beagle may not be the perfect choice for you. And we're already halfway through this video. How do you feel about Beagle so far? Do you think they fit your home? Let us know your thoughts later on because for now, we have a few more things to talk about these amazing dogs. So let's continue. Number 5. Beagles are not excellent guard dogs. Due to their social and friendly nature, beagles are not the best option if you're looking for a dog that is capable of protecting your family and property from dangers. Although they will bark to let you know if someone is approaching your home, it is more likely a greeting or a way to show their excitement in meeting the person. The good thing about this is that they make great companions and playmates with kids since their energy levels match each other. Number 6. Beagles are prone to obesity. Beagles are not picky with their food. As a matter of fact, they love their food a little too much that their owners need to closely monitor the amount of food that they consume to ensure that they don't suffer from obesity. Whenever you're eating, expect them to give funny stunts or puppy eyes just so they can get a share of your food. You should be firm and not easily give in. Otherwise, they will get used to it, which can result in poor health conditions in the long run. Number 7. Beagles are mouthy. Aside from food, beagles also like to munch on things which they think are edible, such as your shoes and clothing. This is especially true when they are in the mood to play. Therefore, make sure that all your valuables and expensive items are far from their reach. It will also be a huge help to provide them with a variety of toys that they can play with so that they won't see your personal items as chew toys. Number 8. Beagles need plenty of exercise. Since they are originally bred to hunt, expect that beagles will not be satisfied from a short walk. With their unlimited levels of energy, this breed is always up for new adventures anytime. Therefore, aside from long walks, make sure to engage them in activities that are physically and mentally stimulating, such as training them for canine sports. If you are not able to meet their exercise requirements, you'll find your beagle running laps all over your house to burn off their energies. And while it is a cute sight at first, you'll soon realize how many fragile things are at risk from breaking inside your home. In the end, beagles are energetic, affectionate, and social dogs who are best suited for those who can handle their personality. If you're an active person who likes to meet new people, and if you can dedicate time for their daily needs, then this breed will make a lifelong companion who can live for 12 to 15 years on average. And there you have it, the 8 reasons why you should not get a beagle. After watching this video, do you think you have what it takes to properly raise a beagle? Or do you think this is not the best option for you? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment section down below. As always, if you enjoyed today's content, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. To be notified when we upload new videos, make sure to click the notification bell button. 
Thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.